Today, we're going to dive into the terrifying world of psychic animals. If you're the type who likes to chill in your gluten-free yurt doing mystery drugs, then pay attention. Your pet may be reading your mind. That's right. Those cute little furry creatures you thought were just cuddly companions might actually be harboring some seriously freaky abilities. Brace yourselves, because this is about to get weird. Let's start with the concept of clairvoyance. This word is pronounced as clairvoyance. Clairvoyance. The power that some people claim to have to be able to see future events or to communicate with people who are dead or far away. You know how your dog always seems to know when you're coming home, even before you've pulled into the driveway? Well, according to some studies, that might not just be a coincidence. Researchers have found that dogs can somehow sense when their owners are on their way back. But it gets even weirder. Some people claim that their pets can actually see ghosts or spirits. Your cute little kitty might be able to spot the ghostly apparition of your great-aunt Gertrude lurking in the corner. Talk about a spooky sighting. Now, let's move on to the realm of telepathy. It's the most basic way that we all interconnect. It was, supposedly, who's to know, the way humans connected before there was even speech. One could call it mind-to-mind -mind communication. You know how sometimes you'll be thinking about taking a dog for a walk, and suddenly they'll come running over with their leash in their mouth? Well, according to some pet psychics, that's not just a coincidence either. These so-called animal communicators claim that they can actually tap into the minds of our furry friends and have full-blown conversations with them. They say that animals have complex thoughts and emotions, just like humans, and that they can pick up on these mental signals. Imagine having a heart-to-heart -heart with your goldfish about the meaning of life, or asking your hamster for stock tips. Sounds like something straight out of a horror movie, doesn't it? But wait! There's more! Some people even believe that animals can exhibit psychokinesis, there is Heidi Sawyer. I'm going to give you a little bit of an explanation as to psychokinesis. Okay, so if you find that light bulbs ping around you, uh, electrical items break, especially small electrical items, for no apparent reason, or you find that computers seem to malfunction around you, especially when you're going through strong emotions, either you're getting cross with it or you get overexcited about something, or your car battery goes, quite often it's car batteries, uh, or watches go slow around you, um, then the psychic skill that is wanting to develop in you is psychokinesis, okay? It may be that it's not just wanting to develop in you, it's already starting, so the energy is beginning to build up. You may also have the capacity um, to move objects, okay, using the mind, but that is actually a very difficult skill to be able to harness. You know how sometimes your cat will just stare at you until you get up and feed them? Well, maybe they're not just giving you the sad eyes. Maybe they're using their psychic powers to control your mind and make you do their bidding. Or what about those times when your dog seems to know exactly when you're about to throw their favorite toy, and they're already in position to catch it? Could it be that they're using their psychic abilities to predict your movements and manipulate the trajectory of the toy? It's enough to make your skin crawl. So there you have it, folks. A terrifying glimpse into the world of psychic animals. Sweet dreams, everyone.